Hi, Nicole. Congratulations once again. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's such a pleasure. I feel so fantastic right now. Fresh from your success in Miss International, you're now a beauty ambassador. <laughs> yes, I am. We've had the news and we can't wait to finally unveil. The secret is out. That's right, baby. I am here with Pina. How did this all come about? Wow. Oh wow, I can't even I can't even describe like the moment it started, but I knew that the brand was one that I resonated with, especially because they have a special place for Winnie Beaning Filipinas. Yeah. Get it? That's where they got the name and I love that it supports queens like me. So it's more empowerment of that. Yeah. And you know, you're keeping you're staying afloat, attracting many opportunities. Wow, wow. Wow, indeed. Oh, gosh. I feel like it's just the beginning, you know? But there's even more out there, and I'm just so blessed. And I thank God every day for all the blessings that are coming my way. What's secret of beauty? I don't secret of beauty, mo. Why, you know, brands like Pina Skincare is getting you as an endorser. Oh, wow. I mean, I'd love to hear your opinion on that one. Is it your luminous skin? Is it how you take care of your, yeah, of your grass skin? Thank you for saying I have glass skin. I actually do struggle with acne from time to time, especially hormonal kinds when there's too much stress and whatnot. So it's really all about the balance, right? And if with brands working with me, I like to hope that it's part of my work ethic and my personality that they admire to work with me too, because I love working together with brands. And I hope that that's what shines through aside from just the physical. And what's so special about this endorsement is that everything is Filipino made. Yes, locally sourced and sustainable and it, it, they all focus on this holistic approach. And something that's very, that's very unique in comparison to a lot of skincare these days is that they're actually watermelon based, yeah. right? Like that's part of like their marketing and to think like, when you think of whitening, when you think of skincare, you never really think of watermelons, right? You usually think of other fruits, right? <laughs> but turns out they have a lot of research and they even did surveys before they even launched their product so they made sure to like interrogate not interrogate but like they did surveys and then they found that the benefits that their products can offer is one that's going to cover many of the concerns that people have in terms of skincare all natural ingredients talaga uh, i was like wow and what's great is that they even it smells good it's gentle on the skin and it's it's one that I've been using these past few weeks. Maybe that's a secret right now. <laughs> How important is it for beauty queens like you to really take care of their skin and be on top of the beauty? Oh my gosh, I, I think s skin is almost everything, right? Like, if you don't take care of your body from the inside, it's gonna manifest through the physical, right? So if, if you eat unhealthy, it's gonna, in my case at least, it, it's gonna show in my, my skin. If, if I don't sleep well, then it's gonna show in the eye bags, right? Everybody struggles with these things. And I hope that people who are watching this know that it's normal to experience these things. Like you aren't any less the person that you are if you don't have perfect skin. This is completely normal. And the whole point of skincare is to improve that part of you that like, it's, it's okay to experience it. and. We'll do it one step at a time. And Pina's going to help you with that journey. Wow, you're so relatable. Grabe. Super. Wow. <laughs> Thank you. Despite your sheer beauty, wow. You make yourself relatable. Wow. And speaking of being relatable, Grabe, Binibining Pilipinas Finals is fast coming up. Oh my gosh. Any advice for all the girls who have been in your situation before? God, you know, I guys, I love Bini Bini Filipinas. They're such an amazing organization. They take really good care of their girls. I, it's been two years since I've since I've won, and yet I still feel so excited to attend their to attend their events. And now is a very, very special year because it's their 60th anniversary. They've got God knows what they have in store for this year. I'm so, so excited. So a piece of advice to the girl who is next to be crowned. It's, it's the same advice I always give, you know? I'd say like, show your heart right a lot of the times people keep thinking oh i gotta be this i gotta be that and at the end of the day people just want to see what's inside and people don't want to have to just keep looking at someone who's plastic right they want they want what you stand for they want to know 
how your mind works. So just give them that and don't overthink it on the night. Oh my gosh, it's so easy to get the, to get the jitters when you're standing backstage. So I'd say let it all out, pray it out, um, do some self-regulation exercises. What I always do, um, I'm gonna, like, I would like blow air out of my mouth. So it's like, whew, like deep breathing, right? Shake it out if you have to, whatever works for you. But remember to just be in the moment. Do your best. God will do the rest. How do you feel you're part of the legacy now? 60, 60 glorious years of Binibining Pilipina. You know, they actually have a, a book coming up. I don't know if it's a secret, but there's a book coming out and they invited... Oh, I hope this is not... Okay, whether this is like a secret or not, they're coming out with a book. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> if I'm the spoiler, I'm sorry. But there's a book coming out and there's they're, they're taking 60 queens f throughout the history of Binibining. That's what I understand. I'm not, I could be wrong. I hope I'm not spilling out <laughs> too much <laughs> secrets or something. But I got invited to it and I thought, wow, I get to be a part of a legacy here. And it's not just being crowned. It's going to be on paper. You're going to have something to bring home. And it's going to be like, I can't imagine myself getting the chance to share this to my grandkids one day. All right. Maraming salamat, Nicole. God bless. Thank you, you too. Congratulations again on your new Thank you, it's a pleasure. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs>